Hello, my Libra friends. Hello. Thank you for joining me. And this is a reading for Libra for the week starting July the 20th. It was an experiment last week and it worked well. You so much support. I thank you for that. It was fun for me as well. Learned a lot. And I'd like to continue. Um, let me give you bits of information. At the beginning of the uh, video, the introductory section, you'll see my website. Take a look for the things that I offer, the services I offer, and um, also my email if you want to contact me should you feel that I could help you with an inner private reading. Also, I have had for some time a web page, a um, Facebook page, but recently I opened a fan page in my name, Christelle Martinet, under Performance Arts, Performing Arts. Now, why I signal that to you, if you go and like the page, every day I pull a reading, I pull a, car, a number of cards, depending on the um, deck that I use, I use different decks, and I ask a question, and it's sort of an interaction with my subscribers. I'll ask, for example, what is the focus of your day today? Where will, you, where will your efforts be spent today? And I will give a clue or I will give a partial reading and you can chime in and give me questions, ask for different things and we'll see if it's a way of adding sort of a um, game-like aspect to uh, divination and the divination proper and learning, you know, we'll all be learning from each other. So that is my fan page, Christelle Martinet. I'm using the Wild Unknown Tarot again. I'll use the five card spread as I did last week and integrate it with my other decks. Well, Libra, my friends, the Page of Pentacles has come up first. The Empress, and in the middle of the spread, the Six of Swords, the Hermit, and the Seven of Cups. This is a, for anyone who has read just a little bit of tarot. It, it can be mind-boggling. It could be an enigma, but you must remember that they do mirror each other. The, the Page of Pentacles mirrors the Seven of Cups, and the Seven of Cups is an um starting to doubt yourself, you going against the grain, and um, the Page of Pentacles, on the other hand, is a spiritual message. Again, and also, the Empress and the Hermit are two major arcana where the Empress is a manifestation of the female energy, and the Hermit is a sort of study. It's a guiding light for us to sit back and watch, and take things as they have come before us and try to understand them. And the focus is on the Six of uh, Swords. I'm getting the um, message of ana analysis. Analyze. Watch. Look. Analyze. Um, I'm going to take the Vida Sibila cards on this and illuminate some of the cards. First of all, first of all, <laughs> how do you like that? You like that word, first of all? First of all, I will um, illuminate the four, yes, the seven of cups, it, which is our number five card in the spread, and it's mirroring the page of pentacles, the message of spirituality. Hmm. Well, um, hmm. quite literally, we have love, hope, and trip. Yeah, a man on a horse, moving. Now, this seven of cups, where there's one cup ahead of the pack and the other is just left back, is telling us that you, there's an element of doubt here, there's an element of doubt in terms of your emotions, you have high hopes, very high hopes. You've been, Lord knows, you've been um, hit hard in the emotional um, department, but you have not lost your hope. And this is an excellent, an excellent thing because towards hope, there is the horseman riding. 
Let me take the Neapolitan cards on that. Excellent, excellent message of hope. Right after the Hermit, actually, after your analysis. Mm, strong cards, the very strong messages. We have the Page of Swords, the Knight of Pentacles, and the Ace of Wands. Now, again, um, this is an excellent omen because the Ace of Wands is a male energy to counteract the female energy in the Empress. Excellent, excellent. You're finding balance towards the end of the week. Um, clearing the air with the Page of Swords. In comes, enter stage right, spirituality on that horse very, very quickly. The, the idea, the watchword here is to have, keep the faith, because towards end, weeks end, you'll be balancing out. It'll be, a, it'll be rough going in the first couple of days. Keep the faith. Towards weeks end, you'll be balancing out. Let me take the, um, the fine arts postcards. Let me pull one to see if we can crown our reading. There's one that's dying to come out. Let it, no, it's going back in. Well, wow, they're dying to come out. A couple of them are dying to come out. Let's see if they're pulled out for me to pick one. Well, this has come up also for another another um, sign. This is Rousseau, the portrait of Miss, uh, Monsieur X, Mr. X. Now, as you can see, this has come up last week as well. This is a pose, a pose, an exotic pose. A man who looks from uh, as if he were from a country that may not be ours, unless you live in Turkey, perhaps. Um, a cigarette he's holding that is not lit. A cat that almost seems fake. But it does give you a picture, a posture of exoticism. Now, this tells us that we need to tap in our, our particular individual form of spirit, spirituality. Think of what is important to you. Not only now, but what is important to you in the near future and in the far future. Your beliefs, your underlying beliefs. This is to asking you to analyze your underlying beliefs do so, especially towards the end of the week, after you have gone through a little rough patch in the first few days, and you'll come out knowing yourself more and having a bit more direction in terms of where, what you look at when your eyes are raised. Okay, let me leave you with that message. Namaste, my Libra friends. It was a pleasure to read with you. Thank you so much for your support. Do visit my website. Do visit my fan page. Arrivederci, au revoir. Ciao.